Hi friends, today we will discuss about DCMU and Paraquet which are the two important herbicides that affect photosynthesis. Now uh, before going into the detail we all must know about what is DCMU. DCMU its common name is diuron. It is a derivative of urea. Its chemical name is 3-3-4-trichlorophenyl-1-1-dimethyl-urea. This is its uh, chemical structure uh, uh, where you can see why it is called derivative of urea. This moiety is uh, uh, showing the urea NH2-CO-NH2. Uh, what it does? It competes for the QB site of D1 protein of photosystem 2. For your knowledge, I must tell you that there are two quinones present in the reaction center of photosystem 2, QA and QB. QA is present on D2 protein and QB is present on D1 protein. Now, what is paraquit? Paraquit is also known as methyl valogen. Its uh, chemical name is N N prime dimethyl 4 4 prime by pyridinium dichloride. This is its uh, chemical structure where you can see these uh, two py pyridine uh, structures attached at the uh, four positions. This is 4 4 prime. Uh, what it does? It blocks electron flow by accepting electron from early acceptors of PS1. Now, uh, what happens when uh, these herbicides blocks the uh, photosynthetic uh, traveling of electron? What uh, what happens uh, due to this? Uh, as we know, when electrons are blocked, the intermediates of photo photosynthetic electron flow, they all will remain in reduced state. Reduced state means they are carrying negative charge. And we all know that photolysis of water takes place at photosystem 2 uh, by which oxygen is released. If this oxygen accepts uh, electrons from the intermediates of reduced, uh, uh, which are in the reduced state or they are carrying a, a negative charge, then this oxygen becomes superoxide because it carries one extra electron which makes it highly reactive and this superoxide is also the member of reactive oxygen species. Uh, this uh, superoxide attack on lipid membranes like thalicoid, chloroplast and other cell organelles uh, uh, by which uh, interior of the plant cell gets uh, exposed to the external environment and ultimately that leads to killing or damage of the plant tissue. So this is how uh, of, uh, block, uh, blocking of uh, electron flow uh, uh, creates the reactive oxygen species and in turn that damage plant tissue. The same we can also uh, understand through this simple uh, diagram. As we know, this is the Z scheme in which P680 is the reaction center of PS2 which ejects electron and it becomes uh, 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 it comes in oxy oxidized state and electron travels uh, from other intermediates p700 also ejects electron and ultimately electron travels and it received by an atp to produce an atph suppose two electrons are ejected uh, from p680 uh, then it will become P682 plus then subsequently it moves to other uh, intermediates QA to QB uh, then two electrons are also ejected by P700 it becomes P702 plus then further these two electrons are accepted by NADP and NADPH is produced. So what we observe here that electron 
विच वॉज इनिशियली इजेक्टेड फ्रॉम पी सिक्स एटी और पी एस टू इज नॉट कमिंग बैक दैट्स वाई दिस इलेक्ट्रॉन फ्लो इज नोन एज नॉन साइक्लिक इलेक्ट्रॉन फ्लो uh because it is not having its electron back in that condition ps2 uh has a electron hole which makes it a strong oxidant uh by which uh it it compels a uh, water molecule to photo oxidized uh into oxygen proton and electron now these electrons which are produced uh, by the photolysis of water are taken by the ps2 system and by which it resumes uh, or it has uh, uh, resume its capacity to start another non cyclic electron flow now let's come back to uh, or herbicides uh, when we apply dcmu and paraquet where they block uh, dcmu uh, blocks the electron flow between qa and qb and paraquet blocks the electron flow uh, between p700 or early acceptor of uh, photosystem 1 Uh, so what we see here that if electrons are blocked then uh, the intermediates will remain in a uh, reduced state or we can say they are carrying a uh, negative charge if that electron or negative charge is accepted by oxygen uh, then uh, they will produce a uh, superoxide and this is a highly reactive as we have discussed earlier which attack lipid membranes which is the first line of defense uh, of of any cell or cell organelles which uh, ultimately lead to killing of green tissue so this is the presentation uh, where we uh, learnt about how dcmu and paraquet act by blocking electron flow uh, uh, in the photosynthesis and kills the plant thank you bye bye